What is up YouTube? Four Leaf Cards here. Hey, thanks for clicking. We're just doing some mail days, catching up on that kind of stuff, and uh, glad to have you along with us. Uh, I got the uh, package here. Uh, I don't know what it is. It's something graded. I've been kind of buying some Red Sox uh, stuff, working on team sets. I wanted to get the, all the tops team sets uh, going so you can see we got some of the older uh, vintage ones there already and uh, I think while I was clicking I saw some things that were reasonably priced um, move the camera here a little bit uh, then I grabbed them and that's what happened here this is a uh, 1957 Ike Deloc from the Red Sox in a 7 so really nice quality. I figured, you know, if I'm getting the sets and I can get something graded, I don't know, eventually I might get into something uh, where I do a set registry. Of course, this wouldn't go into a PSA one, but uh, it's a Dave Moorhead. It's a GAI 8.5, but I kind of figured, like, that's probably a PSA 7. Um, actually, it looks pretty good. So I think it'd get a... Nothing on the back. I feel like it would get a 7 if I put it in there. And that's kind of where I'm at. 7s uh, for some of this vintage stuff. 7s and maybe even 6s uh, for some of the stuff from the 50s and 60s. Um, so that's nice. So a couple little additions. They were really cheap. Uh, you know, they both came in the same package. So the shipping was, instead of like $4 each, it was half. It was like $2 each. I think that's the key when you're doing is if you can find a seller that's got a couple couple things that fit your PC to grab those and save on the shipping and then I got another a box of things here and I don't know it might be team sets Ugh. it's packaged very well oh my word is it packaged really well whoa it's getting crazy in here got it about half opened we might just need to use the knife here do a little cheating there we go. And it says thank you. So this must be an eBay purchase. Oh my word, they taped the box too. Just a really good, uh, really good job packing here. Come on. Holy cow. Maybe I should open these before I start the camera. Like Fort Knox. Holy smokers. Painter's tape works too, folks. <laughs> it's a little, uh, that's nice, a little stamp there, a little thank you. Well, thank you for a good deal. Oh, yes, I know what this is. I forgot all about these. This was a really good deal. I got these for a couple bucks. Uh, upper Deck, I don't know what that's all about here. But these are, uh, it's a lot of Jimmy Foxes. Uh, got a little bit about Jimmy Fox. This guy was a beast, and I actually think his nickname was The Beast. Uh, and also, I think they called him Double X, because he's got the uh, the two X's. For Fox, so they called him Double X. This guy was just a power hitter and hit for average. Um, just a really, really awesome uh, batter. Played first base. I think he came up as a catcher. Can't remember if he was playing something else, but they, I think they had him at first base for pretty much his career. So 58 homers in 1932. Um, RBI's over 100 for 13 years. That's just crazy. So I uh, think this is going to be my calling card, if you will. I got a lot of them. Um, a lot is also a lot in, in multiple ways. Um, and these are all super tight cards. So I'm pretty excited about that. And we got one more package. And it is big. And it's from eBay, and I don't even know how to get into it. Gonna... 
Oh, yes. Forgot all about these two, guys. This is exciting. These are 1982. They're unopened. Need a little room here. They are unopened packs of Red Sox players from uh, Brigham's and Coca-Cola. And they're, they're all unopened cello packs. And uh, I think the 82 had 22 players and the 81 had 11 players in the set. Here's the 81s. Collect all 11. And that's what they look like. There's a Tony Perez. Um, so it was, it was a nice little lot of these and uh, I wanted to build this set. Um, so there's a nice Dwight Evans. Now, I don't know if anything's missing in here, but we got a bunch of them. There's a sweet Jim Rice. So I doubt it. If somebody was going to pick through them, they would have taken Rice. There's Yaz. So if somebody was going to pick through, they would have taken the Yaz on the fronts, you know. So I'm pretty happy about seeing that. I didn't, you know, it wasn't in the direction, uh, the descriptions, but uh, there's another Yaz. So I'm pumped. We're going to open some of these up on camera. Um, see if we can't build the set. The 11 card set should be pretty easy. Um, but yeah, so stay tuned at some point. We'll be, uh, doing some videos on the 81, 82 Coca-Cola, um, top sets. Pretty pumped there. Pretty cool lot. All right, guys. Hey, uh, again, be watching for this and, uh, wish me luck on getting the sets. If you guys are open anything, best of luck to you guys. Don't forget to collect to connect. There's all kinds of cool people out there in the hobby and the community. And you guys have an awesome day.